this is exactly what i did to make skin by zaron body lotion work for me hi guys welcome back to my channel if you don't know my name is adironke and i review skincare products also educate you about skincare i'm going to be sharing with you guys step by step things that i did to make this skin by zaron lotion work for me i already reviewed this product if you are here to see the review please click on that link i already finished this product and i'm on the verge of getting another one the only downside to this product for me was the fact that it wasn't moisturizing enough so after using a complete bottle of this product i finally figured out how to make this product moisturizing for me and, and also how to add the brightening effect to work faster so here is exactly what i did so before i used to just use this um skin by zaron body lotion with my um body body soap and my body soap itself was not moisturizing so what i did was to switch to a moisturizing body wash that is very very moisturizing and the one that i started using was this Sense hive soothing body wash it contains oat meat and shea butter and this particular body wash is so moisturizing that even before applying my skin by zyron i already feel like my skin is moisturized enough so this helps with the moisturizing effect that this does not give me enough it's not like this is not moisturizing but it wasn't enough for me so since i started using this body wash together with this skin by zyron i have noticed a huge difference in the moisturizing effects and that is not all i also started using skin by zyron with this scent types exfoliating body wash and what this exfoliating body wash is going to do is to remove the skin cell to ensure that my skin can actually take this product faster that i can penetrate faster it will remove all of the dead skin cells that is blocking uh, my skin surfaces so that it can renew like a radiant um supple skin and then my skin by zaron can then penetrate faster and work better so if you cannot get access to this synthesis as well as body wash, this fresh peach and jasmine, you can also buy the pink lemon and mandarin. In fact, I would prefer you buy the pink lemon and mandarin because the brightening effect is much more better than this one. The only reason why I have this is because I could not get the um, pink lemon and mandarin. So this one is going to ensure that your skin is well exfoliated. And how can you use this? You can use this two or three times a week. And then on days that you are not using this, you use this for the moisturizing effect. Or sometimes if some people like to overdo that they use their exfoliating body wash and then they follow up with their moisturizing body wash so that their skin does not dry out or anything like that. And if you are somebody that don't like body washes, because I have heard a lot of things. A lot of people said they don't like the way body washes feel on their skin. So here is another act for you people that don't like to use body wash. You can use body soaps. So soaps that I would recommend that you can use together with this skin by Zaron is um, Kojivit, um soap. It is already popular, so you should see. If you don't know what Kojivit soap is, then I'm going to put a picture right there. So that soap, it contains kojic acid. And kojic acid is a brightening ingredient. It's a tyrosinase inhibitor. It's going to help reduce the production of melanin in your skin. So it's a brightening product. So if you use two brightening products together, what that is going to give you is two times brightening effect. So imagine using Kojivit Ultra together with this skin by Zaron. Of course you're going to get brightening, more brightening effects. But then the only thing about the Kojivit Ultra is, is that it can be quite drying. So please and please, when you're using Kojivit Ultra, ensure that you are doubling up on moisturizer. So if you cannot double up on moisturizing because this is not giving you enough moisturizing effects and you're using Kojivit Ultra, here is another hack that I found out. You can also start using this Nivea body lotion together with it. So on days that you are not using, or maybe at night that you are not using your skin by Zaron, or possibly you are using your skin by Zaron at night and you don't feel like using it in the morning, you can follow up with this. You can use this Nivea Radiant and Beauty instead. So this one is 
deeply moisturizing like emphasis on the deeply moisturizing it is really deeply moisturizing so if you pair this together with this like maybe on alternate days or maybe in the morning and at night you are going to get the moisturizing effect that you are not getting from this one from this one and if you don't like Nivea, because I see a lot of people claim that this is making them dark, which I already tackled. If you don't know, go and check the product, the video that I talked about this Nivea Radiant and Beauty Advanced Care and how you can ensure that this does not make you dark. And also the mistake you are making that is making that is causing you to get dark from using Nivea. So I'm going to suggest that you get this Vaseline. This Vaseline is also quite moisturizing. This one, I'll say get the LD uh, Intensive Care because a lot of people said the one that is just Intensive Care is weak, so I don't know. Just get the LD Vaseline one and you can use it on alternate days with your skin by Zaron. So what I'm going to say, this skin by Zaron is going to give you like the brightening effect you are looking for. But then, I'm just speaking from personal experience, it wasn't moisturizing enough for me. So if it is moisturizing enough for you, I feel like you can skip all of the moisturizing part of this video and then just focus on the way you can hack the brightening effect. So I'm, also su I'm going to also suggest that you also follow up with a sunscreen whenever you are using this during the day. That's because this contains vitamin C and vitamin C together with sunscreen is like the best combo they are like five and six they like to work together so follow up with the body sunscreen if you don't know any body sunscreen this is atomugi it's from a japan brand and if you don't have access to this you can also get um any sunscreen any sunscreen that works for your face will work for your body the only difference why people don't tend to use face sunscreen for their body is because of how easy it finishes so get a bigger size sunscreen any sunscreen of your choice and apply to exposed area of your body emphasis on exposed so for example now i want to apply sunscreen i'm not going to apply sunscreen all over my body i'm going to be applying it on exposed area like you see from my hands downward yeah my neck and my chest area that is the only place that i will be applying sunscreen so that is what you should do and also Ensure that you're not using sunscreen at night because I see a lot of people making that mistake. You have no reason to be using sunscreen at night. Use sunscreen in the morning. So if you follow all of these steps, I promise you that you are going to get 5x benefit from your skin by Zara. The mistake I see a lot of people making is just getting a single product and you're expecting result of 10 products from it. No, that's not how it works. A lot of people don't tell you the truth, but... You cannot get all of that skincare benefits from just one product. There is a reason why there are multiple products in the market. There's a reason why there's a brightening body wash, there's a brightening body lotion, there's a brightening body serum, and there's a sunscreen. So you follow all of these steps, I ensure you that you're going to get the most benefit from your skin by Zara. So, so that is all for this video. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to hit the like button. Share this video with anybody that we know that will benefit from this video and give me a subscribe see you guys my next love you